What's up, fellas and ladies? This is WVALS03, and yeah, this is more Ocarina of Time Master Quest. In the last episode, I beat the Dongo's Cavern. Well, I completed it. Killed the King Dodongo. Daryana was happy, he gave me the Goron's Ruby, which is the second spiritual, st the spiritual stone. And uh, yeah, we're on our quest to get the third. But he told us to go up to Top of Death Mountain, because there's a fairy that will power us up, whatever that means. This is a little tricky here. No, not right here. Gotta have good timing right here. But yeah, which I don't. There we go. And if you bomb this, there's something. I forget what this is. Isn't there like a cow down here? Yeah, hearts and a cow. And rupees, which I don't need because I can only hold 99 right now. I gotta get the wallet, the adult's wallet. How many uh, tokens do I have? Oh, I got 10. I can go there and get it. We'll do that. Now, this is where the Hylian shield is very helpful whenever you're small equip it you see he kind of it's too big for him so he just basically ducks and the whole shield shield protects his like head and back area here which is great because as you climb up death mountain an eruption happens starts and rocks come flying out of the sky molten rocks Usually I just run like hell. If I get hit, I get hit. But hell, I'll demonstrate it. I don't care. There we go. Come on, make it. I don't wanna wait again. Make it. Okay. Where's that other one at? Is there one waiting up here for me that I have to shoot? Oh, there's our owl friend. So bomb right here. And it takes us to our first grade fairies found. So you'll see this Triforce marking on the ground. Pull out your ocarina. The staff will appear and play Zelda's lullaby. Easy as that. Ah, oh, it's one of these crazy fairies, yeah. Like how the that Goron said. Yeah, Link's mouth's like open, like, man, you are ugly. I like how the Goron said, you'll meet a beautiful fairy atop Death Mountain. Well, I guess any females could look into a Goron, who's like basically half a rock, half person. She gives us the spin attack, so we all know about the spin attack. 
was it was actually introduced in Link to the Past. One of my favorite Zelda games of all time. I haven't really met a Zelda game I didn't like. Well, the CDI games, God. I know they're not recognized as part of the Zelda series, but man, it's just a shame they were they were released and Zelda was their title because man, they were bad. There we go, so we get our magic meter, which is below our hearts, and uh, we can use a spin attack. If you hold the B button, you see the magic meter kind of blinking, and then swing, and it you see that like wave of magic go around that will destroy enemies, or at least hurt them. And a little bit of our magic meter, our magic went down, but yeah, that's the spin attack. Shut up, Navi. Alright, so I kind of want to go back to Goron City, but well, we can do this. Let's talk to our friend, the Owl. Well, it looks like you've grown up a little from the Great Fairy's power. But you still don't really look like the hero who will save Hyrule. Thank you for that. Well, at least not yet. If you're going back down the mountain, I can lend you a wing. Yeah, hop on my uh, talons. Talons, talons, whatever. There we go. Hit the A button. And he flies us down to Kakariko Village again, and he actually drops us off right here. Now, if you're careful. We're, in, we're on the roof right above the cuckoo lady. There she is down there. Now you see this little platform down here. Jump. There we go. Go in through here. This is how you get that piece of heart. Oh, nice. And I have collected four. So now we increase another heart container. Nice. Alright, so now that I have 10 gold Skaltula coins, let's go to the House of Skaltula and get this adult wallet. So we can hold more rupees. Where's the first? Ah, there he is. Way over here. The curse has been broken. Thank you. Here's a reward for you. Yes, the adults wallet. Adults are allowed to carry a lot of money. Now you can hold up to 200 rupees. Please save my other brothers too. I'm sure they will give you something a lot better. Huh? Will you do it? Yeah. I'll at least save your brothers because your last brother, whenever I have 50 coins, will give me a piece of heart. But as for your dad, uh, I'm sorry. I think he's gonna stay a spider forever because I don't want to collect every single coin in the game. All right, ah, what should I do? Ah, let's go back up. Um, let's go back up to Goron City. I'll meet you up there. All right, well, we're pretty much there. Let me use the bomb here. This is the second place to bomb out on Death Mountain. There's a treasure. What is this? Ah, 50 rupees. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Alright, let's go in here. And hopefully I can do this with eight bombs. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That's something uh, added to the uh, game here. A big girl on spinning around. Let's see if we can uh, get him. We have to do the same thing we did to uh, Daryana's son whenever we're an adult. We have to have a bomb explode as he's. There we go. First try. 
All right, I'll give you this in praise of your courage. Gives us a bigger bomb bag. We can hold up to 30 now. Which is totally awesome. Oh, yeah, totally awesome. And then he rolls over us. Thank you. All right. See if I can toss a bomb in this giant pot. Oh, that sucks. I was so off on that. Let me get straightened up here. There we go. Michael Jordan, look out. Uh, I didn't get a heart, piece of heart for the first time. Huh, that was weird. I guess try it again. I thought usually you get a piece of heart right off the bat. That was strange. There we go. That was weird. I guess it's just random. You got a piece of hearts. All right. Anything else to check out here? There's our buddy, our brother. Eh, not now. I'm busy. All right, well, I don't think I have... Eh, I can show you something. Uh, where's it at? What is over here? Nah, that's not where I want to go. I'll go there later whenever I'm an adult. Ah, over here. waste the bomb. Now you see this big ass Goron just kind of chilling down here. Well, break your pot. It's like a furnace or a fire, a fire stove. I'm working on something really cool right now, but I think it's going to take a while. If you wait five or six years, it should be ready, okay? Yeah, this guy, I think, will offer to make you a Goron sword. Do not, do not let him. Go let the other guy on top of Death Mountain make it. Because if that guy makes you one, it will break. Yeah, it will break. And you'll be shit out of luck. And I think he charges you like 200 rupees too or something. I don't know, I can't remember, but yeah, don't do it. Um, all right, now I'm lost. I've played this game millions of times. So I don't know how to get up to the next level over here. Yeah, maybe, no. Yeah, no, yeah. <laughs> All right, well, yeah. I'm gonna meet you back to, uh, I think, Carico Village, or Lon Lon Ranch. We haven't even been to Lon Lon Ranch yet. So I'm gonna meet you right outside of Lon Lon. 
All right. Here we are. Good old Lon Lon. In the daytime. Let's go out to the uh, corral here. Hello, horsey. There's Milan with a little horsey. Oh, it's the fairy boy again. Quit calling me fairy boy. I heard that you found my dad. How did you like the castle? Did you see the princess? Hee hee. Dad came home in a hurry after you found him. Hee hee. Oh yeah, I have to introduce you to my friend, fairy boy. She's this horse. Her name is Apana. Isn't she cute? Yep. She ran away from me. It seems like Apana is afraid of you, fairy boy. Ugh. My mother composed this song. Isn't it nice? Let's sing it together. Let's lock on to her and pull out the ocarina. Oh, cute ocarina. Are you going to play this song with that ocarina? Why not? All right, here it is. There we are. Yeah, Link looks at his ocarina like it's gonna blow up. And it's a Pana song, huh? And there's our owl buddy. Ah, uh, and there's a Pana. She pushes us like 50 feet. <laughs> And she keeps pushing us. Okay. Oh, Pana, she's grown fond of you, fairy boy. <laughs> uh. The girl called me a fairy boy. Uh. Check out what's in here, in the stalls, the stable, or whatever. Who's this guy? I can't believe that I, the great Ingo, am working on this dump of a ranch. Oh, come on, dude. Because the owner is so lazy, I always have to do all the work around here. I, the hardworking Ingo, should be in charge, not that lazy bum tell on. Well, maybe. Oh, uh, yep. All right, let's see if I can play this game real fast. There he is sleeping again. Yeah, maybe Ingo's are a little right. Oh, well, I'll be if it ain't that forest kid from the other day. By the way, thanks a lot for waking me up. It took some doing, but I finally got Milan back in a good mood. So, what are you up to today? Got some free time on your hands, you say? Well, how about a little game? The three cuckoos I have here are super cuckoos. I'm going to throw these cuckoos into that their gaggle of normal cuckoos. If you can pick out these three special birds from among the normal cuckoos within the time limit, I'll give you something good. If you can't find them, I win. It'll be 10 rupees. Yeah, we'll play. Alrighty then, get ready. Normally, if you're turned around at an angle, you can see where he throws through. Okay. Uh, so one right now, the one right. Okay, there's the first one. Oh. Okay, there's the second one. That was just locked. What about this one? No. Come here. No, I lost. Well, you know what? I'll do this next time in the next episode, and uh, yeah, yeah, we'll, we'll we'll get her done next episode. So yeah, we'll try again. So this has been W Balls O Three. I'll see you guys next time, and yeah, have a great day.